My beloved BBL team, the Melbourne Stars, have been pretty ordinary for the last couple of years, so today I'm hopping on Cricket 22 to try and turn around their fortune. Considering we finished last, and we finished last pretty much every year, we're going to take on the top of the table, Perth Scorchers today. The Scorchers have made 165, we are batting second and uh, chasing, and I'm going to see if I can get the Stars an underdog victory at the MCG. The worst team in the BBL playing the best team in the BBL, chasing 165 runs at a very big MCG. It's big boundaries, so there'll be a lot of ones and twos, but getting it to the, the rope is gonna be a tricky task. Keep that run rate healthy early. I think we can be okay. That's a great shot by Stoin. That is a great shot off the back foot. Berendorf a little bit loose with that ball. And the Stoins made him pay. There will be a loose one here or there. We just got to make sure we, we punish it. Oh, God. I, I got scared. The Stoins would have got the body away from that one. What's he bowling there for? That's got to be punished. That has to be runs. If he's going to pitch it there, you got to make the man pay. Oh, great running. We ran three. Clark got back. Well done. Oh, it's a misfield. It's a misfield. There's no way it goes for four. We'll get two. 11 off the first over because of a misfield. Couple of loose balls by Berendorf. The Scorchers are off to a bit of a stinker. Oh, that's a great shot by Stoin. Stand and deliver. That has to go all the way. And, oh, I was going to say, if that didn't... I, it, the, the boundaries are so big at the MCG, you can never tell if it actually goes or not. In swinger has absolutely done me something silly. Oh my goodness. Marcus Stoinis has attempted to cut an in swinger. Well, it brings upon an exciting opportunity for a man on debut. C. McDonald is playing his first big bash game, coming in first drop in the second over. I don't think that's how he intended to start his BBL career. Pretty handy first shot if you ask me. Hasn't quite gone all the way. It fills Stars fans with some confidence knowing they've got such a talent, such a prospect out there. Even though it's his first game, you just know what he's going to bring. Nah, I keep finding the fielder. That's all right. A little bit of debut nerves for the great man. If he bowls that length again, I might try and tuck it. Just backward a square. It's, still doesn't have the pace to go. Berendorf is too slow. I've oh, got to go here, Clark. Got to go, got to go. Oh, my goodness gracious me. Oh. Jesus. That swing is doing me dirty. I don't, oh, jeez. The bloody keeper's taking an absolute screamer. Glenn Maxwell to come in next. McDonald yep. rocks onto the back foot. And tucks that one. So we're going to have to run all these runs, aren't we? Straight down the ground. It could go all the way down in front of the members, and it does. In front of the side screen of the members. Save your legs, Joe Clark. If they pitch it there, you've got to punish it. Pick it up okay. He's hit that straight down the ground. He's going to have to run. He's going to have to run. He's going to have to run. Well done. Good running, boys. Very early into this innings. There's no need for risks right now. Why is he standing on off stump? Yeah, yeah. Well done. Off the back foot. Tucks it into the onside. And we know we're going to have to be Louis Phillips today and just get on the run between the wickets because it's very hard to hit the boundaries here at the MCG considering the ball is absolutely hooping. It's good length. Got to go, got to go, got to go, got to go. Oh, it's good running. Late cut said it's beaten the man. Is that point? I think I've beaten the man at point with my late cut and it hasn't gone all the way. That's okay, though. It was a good shot. Great shot by McDonald. It's beaten the fielder. Is this my... Is this a boundary? It is! McDonald smashes a four through the offside. And he's just starting to feel a little bit comfortable out here in the middle of the MCG. Six overs in, one for 49. And now the field goes out. So another new challenge... 
for the man on debut, McDonald. Oh. Part of you just wants to launch six after six. Like, you get some... Or is that going to go through? McDonald with the late cut. It looks like it's gone through and it's gone for four. C. McDonald finds the gap with the late cut off a good length. I'm not sure that was the, the shot to play, but I've gotten it through the ring and it's gone to the boundary. And he's starting to really feel settled here at the MCG. But yeah, you get some intrusive thoughts when you play this game and all you want to do is just dance and just launch every ball. Anytime I do that, I just get caught on the boundary. So I want to build an innings and play almost conservatively to a degree. 100 runs off 70 balls. I feel like I feel like it's doable. I feel like we're going well. McDonald has absolutely been bamboozled by Pete Hatsakoglu. I've tried to launch one high. I don't think there's a man out there. I've gone aerially, and it's a one bounce four. Just a little scooper over the back there. He wanted to bowl short, and I've said, if you're going to pitch it there, I'm going to flick it out that side. So playing a superb performance at the moment, see McDonald. Appealed for LBW and they've given McDonald out. I'm going to challenge that because I have to. It's a fine delivery. If I haven't hit that, I've hit it. I think I've hit it. I've hit it. I've hit the ball. I was about to turn the PlayStation off. I've absolutely creamed that. I was literally about to turn the PlayStation off, snap the disc and never play again. It was pitched outside. It hit outside. That is a disgraceful decision by that umpire and he should be ashamed. And now C McDonald is just gonna make them pay. I'm just so angry at that. He almost got me out for no reason. And I'm gonna make this Perth Scorcher team pay with their life. I would have been in all sorts. And look at that, Joe Clark says, we'll make them pay. If they're gonna pitch it there, if they're gonna cheat, and if they're gonna pitch it there, we're gonna punish them. Great areas, AJ Ty. Halfway mark of the innings, the Stars. One for 74, McDonald leaving, leading the runs on 32. 91 runs off 60 balls. I need to start getting a couple of boundaries away, I reckon. Early timing, is that gonna cost me runs? It will. A little bit of a nervous time as to be a Stars fan right now. Yep. It's a pretty good stroke, straight by, straight back at Ty. No, 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 don't. Joe Clark recognizing that it's gotta be, there's an element of, uh, oh, there's an element of urgency at the minute. Pressure building here for the Stars after the great start. They really gotta start Ticking it over. That has been flat batted straight down the ground. It'll it'll go. It'll go for four. McDonald getting close to his 50. That was an absolute gift. There's if you can't get that one away, then there's issues with your batting. 78 runs off 43 balls. It's up around the nine and over mark. And I think Clark's recognized that we've got to go. He's found a gap and gone large. thought that was going to go, but it hasn't quite. So we, we run two. Required run rate. Ten and over. We're going at six and over right now. Good shot by Clark. They'll run the single and McDonald will be on strike. That's not going to do it, is it? Probably need to go right now. I feel like McDonald on strike on 44, facing Mitch Marsh. It feels like right now it is go time. I don't want to throw my wicket away, but I just feel like I have to. I've gone large, that's over the field, and that's runs. That's runs, that's what they needed. McDonald raises the bat, that's his 50. He recognized in that moment that he had to go, and did, it's been a pretty nuggety innings, considering the Stoin went out early. And now him and Clark are really building something Quite exciting here. Oh, it's a good shot by Clark. It's a great shot by Clark. 
Goes all the way, and the stars are just fighting back here a little bit. He's got his eye in. Just nips that one off the ribs, and it's gone for four. So it's a great shot by McDonald. The run rate's up around 10 and over. It's getting quite intense right now, and that is just a beautiful flick. He's understood the moment all night. He's gone high and long. And he's been caught on the boundary line, so Clark is gone. And that's the breakthrough the Port Perth Scorchers were after. So we bring in Glenn Maxwell. There's still a little bit of finesse and, and power to come. Pretty good over by Mitch Marsh. I still want that single. I want the strike. McDonald wants the strike. He wants the responsibility. Come on, boys. It's been a great effort. Oh, my God. That's at my feet. Do we go? Do we get... Do we put Glenn on strike? I guess we do. He's, he's a leader and he's experienced, but we need two a ball at the minute, Glenn, and you've just walked into an absolute dogfight. Oh, my God. Glenn, you, you don't have a second to get your eye in, son. You cannot... You cannot do that. We need runs, brother. Glenn! 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 Listen to me, Glenn. Get off the mark. We need to go now. I guess I just got to swing. Oh my god. Is that out? It's six. Glenn Maxwell. Glenn Maxwell says if you need a bit of a chop out, I've got the experience. When's McDonald going to pull the trigger? That's been crunched into the offside. We're going to have to run two. It's gone to the fence. It's gone to the boundary. God. That one's been creamed, but it's probably a single. If I get there, far out, run, McDonald. It's a great shot by Glenn Maxwell. That'll go, will it go? It's been stopped. For all that C. McDonald has done, it won't be enough unless he can get the boys home. So I need, I need at least one six this over. Was it there to be hit? Please get over, please get over, please get over, please get over. That's large. The man in the stands is the only one that can grab that one. That's what we needed. C. McDonald. Oh, this is an innings. This is an innings by the great man. He's been brought in to do a job for the Salad Dweller Stars, and so far he's getting it done. Oh my goodness. That needed to get away. Oh my god, get your head out of that one. <laughs> get your head away from that. I want to keep the strike. So I don't want to force a suicidal run, but I, I really do want to keep this, the strike, Glenn. What have I done? What have I done? What have I done? Oh, we've got there. Okay. Two overs to go. 29 runs remaining. I need to go aerially. I haven't been able to do it all innings. But I guess if there was a time to throw your wicket away, it is now. I've just taken on the delivery. I've danced the ground. It's gone over. And save your legs, McDonald. He gets it away for four. Oh, my God. He's put the stars on his back and said this is what it's all about, folks. 24 from 11 balls. Now that mid on and mid off are up, I can go straight down the ground. It's my favorite shot. That's been stopped. What is it? What do we need? 24. Jeez, I've, I've just got to go for sixes. I, I need a six. Mm. I've just stood. That one was coming between the eyes. He stands and delivers. I've just slashed that one. Is that going to go? Is that going to go? Pace high and wide. And I've just stood and delivered. All right, I want to get back on strike. I want to rotate strike to get Glenn on. Jeez, Berendorf is, is scared. All right, I want to rotate the strike because I want the last over. Oh my God, it's hit me in the head. No, I've got to get, it. Gotta get on strike. Yep. I've done well. I need 13 off the last over to get the Stars home. This has been an exceptional inning so far. 87 not out. 
Six balls remaining. Glenn Maxwell's just looking at me going, it's up to you, son. All right, they put fielders where I like to hit my run, so maybe I'm gonna have to go square. Oh my God, what is that? Oh God, no. We just had to run. We just had to go. I didn't want Glenn Maxwell, who's faced six balls, to have to see the game out, so I just had to run. Oh my god, what is that delivery? It's going to a fielder. I don't want I don't want to run. I'm gonna take it on myself. The commentators are probably saying this is ambitious. He's bowling full and wide. I'm just gonna to have to swing at one of these and hope it goes. I've gone for it. It's gone over the fielder's head. It's beaten the fielder. There was cause for concern. <laughs> it looked like he was coming around. I didn't know if I got enough on it, but I did. What do we need? What do we need? Don't show the distance of the six. Five from three balls. What was that? What was that delivery? We're gonna have to go for it. Uh, have I picked it up enough? Is it gonna go all the way? We're home. The stars are home in a thrilling run chase. Raise the bat, son. Raise the bat. Oh my goodness. If I didn't review that LBW, the disc would have been snapped and we wouldn't have witnessed historics on debut. Oh my God. Look at this. See you later. What a great innings. The Stars have won. They've beaten the top of the table. Scorchers in an absolute ball burster. All right, guys, that is it for another video. I really appreciate the support. I really appreciate everyone getting around the content, and I'll see you all for some more videos very, very soon. Cheers.